224 in Boardman represents the largest commercial corridor in Mahoning County. The Southern Park Mall and a host of plazas attract droves of shoppers from both the city and surrounding suburbs. But this is closer to what Boardman looked like in 1941. A largely undeveloped township filled with miles of wooded areas and green space. But in 1942, residents witnessed the construction of the first local theater. The Newport was a top flight movie house, considered by many to be the finest neighborhood theater ever built in the valley. We are here today with Jerry D'Amico of Fred D'Amico Realtors, and we're gonna be talking about the old Newport Theater. I remember that it was a very active movie theater, you know, and what was really funny, um, you can go to the movies for 35 cents, 50 cents, and 75 cents uh, as an adult, you know, and it was great, you know, and everybody went, it was Saturday matinees they had, and at that time, Bob Fargo was the manager. He was the manager there for four years. And I don't know if you relate who Bob Fargo is, but he used to do the Kenley players for John Kenley. Wonderful, wonderful, brilliant person. And um, so he used to keep it going as best he could. And it was a fun place to go, you know. And I wish they never tore it down because it was a historic site that we should have retained. Very, very uh, upscale for the size that it was. We had it for sale at one time, and um, we were trying to get someone to, you know, buy it and retain it, but it just didn't work out at the time with all that happened economically, and I think that was part of it. Only a few years after the opening of the Newport, another Youngstown and Mahoning Valley institution opened almost next door, Handel's Frozen Custard. Handel's ice cream has long since spread from Youngstown and the Mahoning Valley throughout the United States. In 2006, National Geographic referred to Handel's as the best ice cream on the market. This stand, located on the south side of Youngstown, is often referred to as the original location. But the first Handel's opened inside of what was a gas station, right here at the corner of Market and Midlothian in 1945. Many a theater goer from the Newport came over to Handel's for a cool custard after a mid-afternoon's matinee. But unlike Handel's, the Newport eventually closed, and after years of neglect, was torn down to make way for a Burger King location. Yet the spirit of Boardman's first theater lives on in the memories of generations of theater goers. Join me for a trip into Youngstown's past in Lost Youngstown, available from the History Press.